Hello, this is Greg from SharePoint Maven. And in today's video, I want to show you a few examples of various, um, you know, internet portals that you can design with SharePoint Online. Now, I decided to uh, record this particular video because too often I am approached by uh, my, uh, you know, clients and my uh, loyal uh, followers, and they would like to know and see uh, what is really possible um, uh, to build from the internet, you know, company internets, you know, standard point in SharePoint Online. Now, what you see right now on the screen is just kind of an example I built, you know, manually uh, for my own organization, the internet with, you know, uh, the home site with various, you know, department sites and various types of, um, you know, department sites and pages and so on. However, what is really possible, all right? Uh, this was my take, I guess, but what's really possible um, uh, in SharePoint Online? So there are actually a few options available to you when it comes to uh, to kind of evaluating and seeing what's possible in SharePoint Online. The first option is available to um, essentially all the site owners, all right? Uh, let's say here's a use case. You maybe, um, you know, have a blank, uh, you know, communication site, right? You have no idea where to start, or maybe you are about to create a, you know, a, a communication site and create an internet for your organization. You just have no idea where to start. You don't even know wh what's possible. So in this case, what you can do is navigate to the gear icon, apply a site template and you're going to see a few, not too many, but a few choices available uh, for the design of your site. And, you know, some of them, are, I mean, most of them, I think, are based on some specific use case. If you're looking to build a department, for example, uh, Microsoft has a template for that. Uh, if um, you're trying to maybe create a, an HR department, right, there is a, a, even a template for that. Uh, let's see what else is available. Organization home, here is a good one, probably something that we might need right from the internet standpoint. So here's a template for that. And what's cool about this particular thing, first of all, you can kind of see what um, uh, all these uh, different templates look like, right? But you can also kind of, um, you know, you, know um, uh, you can uh, you can preview it, of course, but then you can also, if you click the use template, it will actually install that look and feel in your site. So you will pretty much end up with everything you see on the screen. Of course, you will need to change the images and, you know, the icons and um, customize it to your organization, but at least you get to see what's possible, all right? And this option is available to all the site owners, so feel free to check it out. Now, another option that's available to you is to utilize Lookbook. If you go to lookbook.microsoft.com, all right, the address I'm right now, at right now, you're going to see essentially a database, a list of all available uh, Microsoft uh, themes and templates you can install in your tenant. And uh, this is a much uh, larger selection than uh, the one I showed you previously. So if you are ever wondering what's really possible in SharePoint Online, um, you know, definitely uh, uh, this is the URL to check out. These are all the templates that were created by Microsoft and they're organized by different, uh, you know, category for different um, types of use cases. But uh, for example, I am going to stay here. Once again, I'm building, let's say the main site for my organization, the internet site, and you know what, I kind of like this template. Uh, once again, um, you kind of see the preview and once again, you can install it. Now, the downside of this particular option that you do need to be the uh, tenant administrator, right? If you're just a regular site owner and you really like this template and you want to imply, apply it to your existing site or something, can do it, all right? You have to be the Microsoft 365 admin to do that, so you will need to involve IT for that. But again, this is yet another uh, option available to you if you uh, kind of want to see you know, all the templates that are available, all right? Does different use cases. So um, again, doesn't really matter whether you're building some department sites or some, um, you know, maybe internet, you know, home sites. Uh, essentially, once again, you can check them out, you know, uh, see uh, the particular layouts you like and then have your IT install them. Um, but very, very important, again, back to the subject of this video, um, uh, essentially, the lookbook shows you what's possible in SharePoint uh, online out of the box. 
it shows you all the various you know layouts available all the various you know widgets been used uh, and essentially, once again, if you're ever wondering uh, what, um, you know, what, uh, um, you know, is possible from uh, building the internet and SharePoint, uh, uh, what are the available choices, what are the available layouts, and how will potentially my internet look like, uh, this is definitely a great, uh, great, um, uh, you know, URL to check out, a website to check out. And uh, again, if you like a particular template, you can always install it. All right. So just wanted to list a few uh, choices available to you uh, again. Um, um, you know, uh, you know, the first option was apply a site template. The second one was this uh, logbook thing. Uh, feel free to check both of them out and they will give you um, a great sense of what's possible. Uh, in SharePoint Online out of the box if you are looking to build a nice, uh, cool looking uh, internet. All right. So that's all I wanted to share in this particular video. Um, as always, happy to see you on my blog, SharePointMaven.com, as well as my YouTube channel. Uh, thank you very much. Have a great rest of the day. Goodbye.